Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or ALS as it's more commonly known, is a condition that first manifests in the fifth and sixth decade of life. So it's mostly, mostly a disease considered to affect the older population. So here we used a technology that we have developed at our lab, which uses teeth to um, measure what's happened in the past. So we use them as a time capsule or as a biologic hard drive, as, as I refer to it sometimes. Because once they capture the signature of the environment in our metabolism, it gets logged away. Once we obtain a tooth from a patient, we can map many things that they experienced in early life. In this case, we were interested in their metabolism of essential elements like zinc and copper, but also of toxic metals like lead and arsenic. I think we have shown that it is possible to detect signatures of late life disease uh, all the way right at the beginning of life. And I think that can be a uh, useful sort of platform to explore in the future. We hope in the long term that this will lead towards preventive strategies uh, because we are identifying biochemical pathways. We can work with our colleagues in drug development to alter those pathways. Uh, we can always change aspects of our, our metabolism and our environmental exposures, but we struggle to change our genes which is what's exciting about this work, that we're pointing at pathways that we could potentially modify.